gonna be one of those videos I'm gonna keep on forgetting to make or not getting round to making unless I do it now we'll start it now because otherwise it'll like run too late I think so the final meal of the day is um rice pudding and we always recommend that our new owners keep to that routine so they give them rice pudding for their final meal of the day when they go to their new homes. Even if they only do it for the first few days, it will help the puppies settle into their new homes. Um, because it's the same routine and they have rice pudding and they go to bed. Like I don't do anything else with them after that. I mean, unless they obviously hear issues or problems somebody really crying out which has never happened so far so it's not to say I'm not around but it just is to say that nothing else is happening they're not coming out they're not having cuddles they're not being handled they are being left they've obviously got water overnight they got water all available all the time but that is our start of our routine Hopefully, I shall remember to make this video and continue to make this video in the morning. It's their first meal. Here's a bit of milk from Judith. She'd rather not be feeding them, but she's so full. And she just has to. for their main breakfast which is always raw they have two um blocks tubes whatever you want to call it of raw um and one of them is always chicken so for me you see a lot of dogs who have allergies intolerances whatever to chicken so it makes sense to give them chicken every day so they can build up a level of tolerance. Um, it's just my opinion. People may disagree, that's cool, that's fine. But um, I believe it's really important for that. And if they do ever develop an intolerance to chicken, during their lives, I can hand on heart say that it didn't happen when it was in this house because they get fed it every day. Um, as you can see, they eat well. Um, and as you can also see, they're ready to upgrade to a bigger size donut bowl, which I will get ready for them for their next couple of meals today because not really much room around here for them now. <laughs> but anyway, they manage for now. And yeah. So lunch is kibble and goat's milk. Which they do really enjoy. Puppies! Brrr, you want to eat? Is up there in their bigger bowl now, as you can see. They have a lot more room around the bowl for them. So, I believe in just giving them an all round diet, a little taste of all potential food sources like kibble, like cooked, like raw, um, and they just get that sort of experience that 
taste for being able to eat multiple things, multiple grains. And you're also moving puppy pads around the pen because that's good fun. But yeah, they get that sort of um, exposure to different foods. And you know, they'll all have their favourites, favourite meals, but it feels like they'll be adaptable in their new homes, which is the whole thing of raising a puppy is getting them to adapt to their new homes, fit into their new homes as best as we can. So their last meal in 24 hours, excuse that, that is mud, not poop, believe it or not, on Miss Lavender um, is kibble. And today they've got cottage cheese and ham with the kibble. Um, and this meal is always kibble and something. Sometimes it's kibble and um, wet puppy food. Oh, he doesn't want to wake up. Um, and sometimes it's something like cottage cheese. Um, sometimes it's just cottage cheese. Sometimes it's just ham, but something with kibble, basically. Um, and like they don't have the same thing for this meal two days in a row. The other meals remain consistent, as in raw for breakfast, um, kibble and goat's milk for lunch, and then rice pudding for tea. And the only consistent bit, I guess, is the fact that it's um, kibble with something. But yeah, anyway, this meal swaps and chops a bit. Sometimes it's scrambled eggs with the kibble. Yeah, literally like whatever I fancy giving them. They ha they like it though. I think they quite like the variety in what they get in. And um, as you can see, they're tucking into it well. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Bit of a different video for what I feed the puppies in a day. And um, yeah, I shall see you all soon. Bye.